Now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, live look from the WLKY Chopper HD as we're flying high above Louisville, looking off towards the south, southeast, on into Bullock County, where we have a couple of showers, a few rumbles of thunder that have formed. Matter of fact, there is actually a pretty big storm near Claremont about 15, 20 minutes ago. It collapsed and put down a wind gust upwards of 40 to 50 miles an hour. And that's what some of these heavier cores could do as we move on into and through the evening. Widespread severe weather, I mean, warnings everywhere. No, I am not expecting that, but there could be some isolated to widely scattered strong cells as we move through the evening. All right, numbers in town 88 degrees current temperature humidity 63 percent wow look at the dew point oh is it muggy out there 74 degrees the feel like is 97 at this point in the game here's the radar scan not much happening around the metro maybe a shower trying to form there as you can see as you move south and southeast also there's a couple of shower and thunderstorms right there in between mount washington and claremont as we speak that storm was actually fairly strong as i mentioned 15 20 minutes ago but it has since come down in intensity uh, as we kind of pull out and take a look at the viewing area Big cluster that was in our southeastern communities is now weakening and pulling away. And how about these storms right here across Lawrence County, just west of Paoli, working on into Du Bois County in Indiana. And there's more activity out near Evansville and Paducah. And this is what continues to slowly work off to the east. So the bottom line, next couple of hours, it does look fairly quiet across the region. Most of the storms north and northwest of Louisville. As we put the loop in motion though, nine o'clock tonight, notice that broken line of showers and storms extending from southwest to northeast, really very close to Louisville. That's when we're gonna really pick up the chances for some heavy downpours, some thunder and lightning, and with the strongest cores, even some gusty winds in spots. Bottom line, it's a slow moving front. There's some upper level energies. So the chances for showers and a few rumbles will continue through the overnight as well. Let's move ahead to your Saturday. In the morning, we wake up to maybe an isolated shower, but a lot of dry time as well. If you have outdoor plans tomorrow, don't cancel them. But just know a few widely scattered showers will be possible. Here's lunch hour tomorrow, and you can see what I'm talking about. Then by mid to late afternoon, most of the activity will be settling farther and farther off to the south. High temperatures tomorrow, a little bit cooler because of the clouds and the expectations of a few scattered showers. We'll be in the low and also the middle 80s. And then the second half of the weekend, yeah, there's going to be a chance for a shower, but the best chances look to be south of Louisville. Here's why an upper level system drops in across the region. And as we move through Sunday, watch what happens here. There they go. Scattered showers and storms mainly to the south of the metro Sunday afternoon. Now here's our forecast in detail for your weekend. Warm muggy, certainly, then scattered showers and storms increasing later this evening for the metro mid to late evening, a little earlier to the northwest, a little later to the east southeast as temperatures drop through the 80s. Tomorrow's forecast again, not an all day washout, but a few showers from time to time. They'll settle southward by mid to late afternoon as we reach 86. We'll hold on to a chance for a shower mainly south of Louisville on Sunday, 85. And then the weekend moves on. Here comes the new work week. Vicki Rick, we try it out and heat it up again as that typical July heat and humidity makes a return. We're back near 90, if a little bit better than that, and lows at night in the 70s, so. Hmm, turning yeah. it back up, huh? Another warm week. Yeah, another warm warm week on the way, and uh, you know, just a scattering of showers. So uh, a lot of dry time also this weekend. All right, thanks, Jay. Okay.